My name is Louise Mothersole and I'm one of the UK Horizon Europe National Contact Point team. My specialist area is the transport sector, so I work with my colleagues in the climate and energy sector because together we are a cluster within Horizon Europe called Climate, Energy and Mobility. Connell McGinley, who you'll see elsewhere, looks after the energy part of the programme and Nick Wallet looks after the climate part. I do the mobility part, which is also transport, not to be confused with things like mobility of researchers. We're talking about mobility of systems, people, things, uh, transport systems in particular. So anything that's around cars, planes, buses, ships, trains, bicycles, uh, and all of the supporting systems that go with those. So the infrastructure, the logistics systems, the digital systems, the information systems, everything required for a transport system or any part of that transport system, a sub part, a sub component, down to the brake linings in a, on a bicycle, then that's me. So if you have an innovation or a technology idea or a project that you're looking to seek funding for in the transport sector, then I'm the person you should be talking to. Uh, I've been doing this job since 2014 when I started on Horizon 2020 and I've always worked in the transport sector in the innovation space. So I've got a lot of experience of how to make Horizon Europe work for you. So my role is to help you understand the rules, the process, the regulations, the how you fill, build a consortium because these are all internationally consortium built programs so you'll need to have uh, partners from around Europe to help you with your, your project and my job is to help you put those teams together too. So the job I do in the UK, there's one of me in Italy, France, Germany, Spain, around Europe and actually internationally too. I'm very familiar with my colleagues in Turkey, Iceland, Norway, uh, Israel, Tunisia. So my role is to help you form that consortium so I can put you in touch with others around the country and around the world to help you with that. So if you have a project that you're thinking of or you want to think about how to get involved in an international consortium, then please do get in touch. Thank you for listening.